Hey guys and welcome to this video. Today I want to show you how to rotoscope with DaVinci Resolve. So there are three options and two of them are free. So let's start with the first option and go into Fusion. Drag and drop a polygon mask into the node field. Connect the polygon mask. Then hit once the invert box. Make sure you are at the first frame of your clip and start masking. So now the person is masked out successfully. Then go one frame to the right and adjust your mask. But as you can see this option is very time consuming and it doesn't look very perfect so I don't recommend to use this option. So now the second and better option is not built in DaVinci Resolve. So just go to Google Chrome and search for runwayml.com. After you've done that go create an account and log in. And now select the remove background option. Then just drag and drop your clip into this field and drag it down here. Now click on your masking object or your masking person. And the AI will do the rest for you. Ok this looks like a fine mask so let's go one frame to the right. And again this mask is also fine so I just look through the frames if the AI has made some mistakes. So I didn't find one single mistake but maybe you've got some. So if there are some mistakes just play around with the exclude button and with the feather slider. So for example I just don't want his head masked out. So I go with the exclude button selected onto his head and I select his head. And as you can see the head is not masked out anymore and even in the other frames the head won't be masked out. But in my case the head should be masked out so I delete these points by left clicking them. Ok if you are done with your adjustments go to the export page, name your clip, then you can choose your background color. So just don't use a color which is in the scene. Ok now hit the export mask button and go to export. Then simply right click your clip and press download. So back in DaVinci Resolve just drag and drop your clip into the timeline. Select your clip and go into fusion. Press shift and space by at the same time and search for delta key. Select delta key and press add. Then change the background color to the green screen color. And hit the ok button. Now your mask should look like this. So this is the best option you will get for free. And now I will show you the third option with the magic mask. So first of all cut your clip out on which you want to apply this effect and go with this clip selected into fusion. Then press shift and space by the same time and search for magic mask. Select magic mask and press add. Unfortunately if you don't got the studio version you can't use the magic mask. But if you got the studio version you can start masking by drawing. Ok now change the mode to better and hit this button to track forward and backwards. So now the rotoscope clip looks like this. And if you are not satisfied with the outcome just go to matte and here you can change the blur as well as the gamma and you can even invert the matte. Alright but that's it for this video. So I hope this video has helped you. If so then leave a like or a sub to my channel. Thanks for all channel members and for the supporters. Go check the first link in the description to get some nice effects and transitions. And yeah, thank you for your attention, stay creative and bye.